Hola mis amores, Johnny here, and as you can see, I'm gonna be unboxing and reviewing with you my box to start for the month of June. I have used one of the products from this box before, but I'm really excited to see what are the other goodies that I got in here, and I want to show you all as well. So you can see what are some of the products that you might be getting in your own box to charm box this month. And if you don't know what box to charm is, box to charm is a makeup subscription box that sends to your home five full size products of makeup skincare for only $27.99. And as you can see what I'm holding in my hands, mine included these five gorgeous products. So let's talk about them. First one that I got in here is the Dr. Brand Backlick Primer. And this is a glow primer for the face. I used this before I applied my foundation today. I want to show you all how it performs on the back of my hand, just so you can have a reference of it. I honestly was very, very impressed about this primer because of how good my skin felt. As you can see, it's very, very luminous. It's honestly super, super pretty. And at the same time, I was impressed to see a uh, brand that it's like so, so good on skincare do a uh, makeup primer. This is easily gonna become one of my favorite primers to do my makeup all the time. I really, really love the glowy look that it gave me today. I love everything else that Dr. Brand has done in the past, so I, I feel like this is definitely gonna be a great, great primer. The next product that I have in here is this bronzer by Shades by Sean. This is a San Francisco beauty brand and something that I love is that this is one of their bronzers that it comes in their big contour palette. This is the shade La Latte. And just looking at this shade, I think this is gonna be a perfect bronzer for me, so let's bronze my face. I'm gonna take it with my brush that I usually love for contour. Ooh, it's really powdery, I'm scared. Let's see. Oh, honestly, not that bad. I thought that it was gonna be a lot more pigmented. Oh, I love it. I love how like buildable it is, you know? I can not, like I can take it and not be too scared that it's gonna like cut my face, you know? So I'm gonna put a little bit of this all over the place where I usually put my cream contour, which is like back here. I'm gonna do one size of my face only so you can see the difference. And I'm gonna do a tiny bit down here. Because mama, we wanna be chisel, you know? So we blend all of this in. And let's do the nose as well. Oop, not too much. This powder, it's actually really, really soft. I love it. Okay, so this side I have the bronzer and this side I don't. As you can see, this side looks a lot more sculpted. And that's the look that I'm going for, so let me do this on the other side as well. The next product that I got in here is one that if you are subscribed to my channel, you probably have already seen my review of it. And if you aren't subscribed to my channel, what are you waiting for? Click the red button down below and subscribe right now. Did you do it? Okay, good. Now let's continue. So this right here is the Sunkiss Summer Palette by Violet Buzz. And as you can see, I used, I have used this baby a lot but we're gonna do a quick look with her. And I'm also gonna be using the stickers that I actually been loving. Okay, so, I know this looks a little bit weird, but I have really hooded eyes, so I'm just trying to do the best I can. <laughs> and for this look, I'm trying to do something different, so I'm gonna take a fluffy brush, and I'm gonna take the shade Berry Hot, which is this big, gorgeous, shimmer, red shade. And this, I'm gonna apply it all the way up here. Wow, this shade is gorgeous. Like, as you can see, it's very pigmented, but at the same time, it's super shimmery and beautiful. And for this look, I just want something simple but beautiful. So I'm gonna do just that shade up there. I'm gonna continue to blend this out with that same brush and now I'm just gonna remove this and voila we have our cut crease moment I'm gonna take my other favorite shade of this palette which is sensation and I'm gonna fill in all of that part as you can see the shade is actually not as pigmented as it looks on the palette to be honest I think you have to like work it in a little bit, but also while I'm working it in, I also realize that there's a lot of fallout. So now I have to go in and clean that up. So I'm just gonna keep pressing that in. And now for the inner corner, I'm gonna do the shade Sunkiss. I'm gonna blend these two right here. 
Cute. I'm gonna go clean up my under eye and I'm gonna repeat everything on the other eye and I'll be right back. Okay, so now that I have my look, I'm honestly loving to use the stickers. I think it's such an easy way to do a cut crease and other lines and stuff like that. More structural looks, which I'm into it, you know? The next product that I'm gonna be checking out is this. This is the Chela Dual Liquid Eyeliner Pencil. So as you can see, it has one side that it's black and one side that it's blue. I mean, look, it's a one, it has one blue side and one black side. I think this is such a cool product, honestly. Let's swatch it. Ooh, oh my goodness, she's sharp. Oh, okay, oh my goodness, these are good. I think for this look I need black liner, so I'm gonna go with the black, but I'm gonna do another video just to review the blue one because I'm very interested on that. First impression, it's very liquidy, but also, oh, I like it, I like it, I like it. It's very black. Yeah, no, this is pretty good, pretty, pretty good. Should I connect that line? Oh my God, should I do it? I'm always scared of doing the wingy boom, the wingy boom. Wingy wingy boom boom. I'm gonna do it. Nope. Who the hell told me that I needed to do a wing liner? Oh my god. <laughs> I like it. I actually do like it. I'm not gonna lie. I was being too extra about it, you know, but I'm, I'm not mad about it. Now let's see if I can actually do the same on the other side, which I don't think so, but I'm scared, but here we go. I'm gonna try it anyway. This liner is really good. I do have to say, like, it's super, super easy. I think this is like a beginner-friendly liner, you know? And I'm only saying this is a beginner liner because I'm a beginner at liner and I haven't messed it up so far, so... I like it. <laughs> did I just do liner? Like a wing liner? Oh my god, I did a wing liner. Who is she? I don't know her. I honestly don't know, but this liner is very impressive. I really, really, really love it. So far, I think this is like my second favorite product after the palette. And the last product that I got was this one right here. This is the Lip Injection Maximum Plump from Too Faced. And this lippy, uh, it's Maximum Plump. When I tell you Maximum Plump, it's Maximum Plump. I only have a little bit of liner around my lips. This is a clear product, so I think this is gonna go perfect now, but let me show you the before. And now let's apply it. Right away I can start to feel the tingling sensation. Oh my goodness, I can definitely feel the maximum plant happening right now. And now let me know if you can see any difference. And that's it, mis amores. Those are the five products that I got in my box of charm for the month of June. Let me know in the comments down below which one was your favorite. I love the palette. I love the bronzer, the prime. I, I love these four products, but to be honest, my favorite was this one right here. This is a Chela Eyeliner Double Liquid Liner, and this comes in blue and in black. I think this is super innovative, and I love products that you can use in different ways. And the liner itself was actually really, really good quality. I haven't done a wing line in a while, and I was really inspired to do it, so here I am. <laughs> Let me know what do you think about this look down below. I definitely had fun doing it. And now that I unboxed my base box, let me know in the comments down below if you want me to unbox and review the premium box as well for this month. Thank you so much for watching the video all the way until the end. If you haven't yet, please make sure that you click the subscription button down below so you can join the On The Go family where I'm always reviewing makeup, giving you my honest opinion and my tea about some products and some brands and everything that I know in the beauty industry. And don't forget to hit that bell so you can also get a notification whenever I upload a new video. I'll see, I'll see you in the next one, mis amores. Bye. <laughs>